Let me show you how to transfer data from iPhone to iPhone. You have some options to transfer from a backup, iCloud, or AirDrop. I'll show you how to do it. Now we need to head into your settings on your old iPhone and make sure everything is currently backed up so that when we get your new iPhone, essentially we can use that backup to just transfer all of that data from your files, your apps, your photos, your videos, all that stuff. So you can see my last backup was yesterday, the backup size, and make sure everything is turned on here. Essentially, you want everything to be backed up so that when you transfer to that new iPhone, it's as seamless as possible. If it has been a while, just tap on backup now so that you can back up your entire iPhone. Now, all you need to do after you go through this process is go to your new iPhone. And in the settings of your new iPhone, you're just gonna go through the process of setting up that new iPhone. So essentially you can tap on erase all content and settings on your new iPhone, or if you're just first setting it up, it will essentially open up as a factory default iPhone. So if it's a new iPhone that has stuff on it, you'll wanna go through the process of erasing it. However, if you don't necessarily do that, if it is a new iPhone, all you need to do is open up and start that new iPhone. And then it will immediately ask you, do you want to transfer data from your old iPhone? You essentially just need to make sure that backup is done and finished. And then you can transfer all of the data from that old iPhone to the new one. Now, keep in mind, if you just wanted to transfer individual things like photos and videos, you can always go through the process of choosing a specific photo or a video and then hitting share and you could airdrop it to the new iPhone or you could text it to yourself with that new iPhone. You have a bunch of different options for individual files or data.